line in three, two, one, go. Just like that, robots off and moving, looking to score some game pieces here. I've got two, make that three game pieces scored, potentially even four, but it just falls short from the Krypton Cougars. Meanwhile, Bing Ray Robotics looking to get docked by the end of the autonomous period. Superbots doing the same. 29 to 30 in favor of that Red Alliance as the drivers step up and take control. 7045, those are the MC Crusaders already depositing yet another cube there in the blue alliance grid. Superbots up with that wrist of theirs. They drop off that cone, it just finds its way. And that is the first completed link by the Red Alliance. Some heavy hits here, 2180 nearly toppling over, but they catch themselves at zero gravity. 484 running into their own alliance partner there as they try to make their way to the blue alliance loading zone. They find it now. Roboforce looking for a game piece from their human player down the chute. They've got that cone in their grasp. Pingree and MC Crusaders working in tandem here to deposit those cones on the top row. Now they just need some cubes to finish off that link. The Krypton Cougars just falling short with that last cone on the top row. An incredibly close match to be seen, 76 to 72 now in favor of that blue with a little under one minute left in qualification match number 74 here at the 2023 First Mid-Atlantic District Championship. Up and over these robots go, looks like 203 dangling some parts out on the field. Let's hope it doesn't impact their gameplay too drastically. Looks like it could be a bundle of wires detaching there from the intake. Another hard hit here between Pingree and Roboforce. But Roboforce still able to deliver that final game piece. Make up a link here for the Blue Alliance. Blue needing this last game piece that Pingree is about to deliver. And that finishes out the necessary links for each alliance to walk away with a ranking point here. Hoping the Red Alliance doesn't cause too much damage as they try to make room for one another on that charge station. With three seconds left, I got two blue robots docked engaged, two red robots docked and engaged, and as time expires, Krypton Cougars don't quite make it back to their community. That final scores up the Blue Alliance coming away with a win, 133 to 128, a five point difference in this match. And it looks like it was all in the grid. Placement of those game pieces is key. MC Crusaders moving on up to rank number 10. Krypton Cougars falling to four.